The Cane Corso bites at 700 PSI. That's one of the most devastating bites in the entire domestic dog world. Let me break down why this number is absolutely insane. First, comparison to other guard dogs. Rottweilers bite at 328 PSI. German Shepherds at 238 PSI. Pit Bulls at 235 PSI. The Cane Corso more than doubles the bite force of a pit bull. It's not even in the same category. Among domestic dogs, only the Kangal bites harder at 743 PSI. The Cane Corso is the second strongest biter on the planet. But it's not just the number, it's what that force can do. A 700 PSI bite can crush human bone like you're snapping a twig. Veterinary studies show that bites above 500 PSI cause catastrophic structural damage, shattered bones, severed tendons, massive tissue destruction. The Cane Corso's jaw structure is built for this. They have massive heads with incredibly thick masseter and temporalis muscles. Their bite isn't quick and sharp like a German Shepherd. It's slow, grinding, and crushing. Once they clamp down, they hold and apply sustained pressure until whatever they're biting breaks. This is why Cane Corsos were used in ancient Rome to fight in arenas and guard estates. They were bred to take down large animals and human threats. That 700 PSI bite could stop a charging bull. Here's the scary part. Like most powerful guard dogs, Cane Corsos don't use full force most of the time. When properly trained, they're gentle with family and have excellent bite inhibition. But when they perceive a real threat, that 700 PSI comes out instantly. This is why Cane Corsos are banned or restricted in several countries. They're not inherently aggressive, but in the wrong hands, they're weapons. An untrained or poorly socialized Cane Corso with 700 PSI bite force is a lawsuit or manslaughter charge waiting to happen. Subscribe to What Happens If for tomorrow's video where we reveal which wild animal has a bite stronger than a Cane Corso.